Yo, yo, what up? Y'all know it's about that time for this update. We're almost to the end of this pattern, man. And I try to make this video multiple times and the weirdest things keep happening that try to prevent me from making this video. So y'all better like, comment, and share this thing, man. And definitely subscribe. And stick with me because I'm about to break this thing all the way down for y'all. But anyways, if y'all been with me, y'all should know about this pattern that I have right here. The pattern, once it starts, after the retracement, it always almost, you know what I'm saying, goes all the way out and play, play like it just like it should, as y'all can see. But anyways, right here where we're currently at, we got it right here. Got an M to the dub. We're in a level one, about to go to our level two formation, right? So here's what I'm thinking. So after we hit level two formation, you know, we might level out for a little bit. And then we'll hit a level three formation. And then we'll get a peak formation. And when that peak formation hits, and I'm going to get to that when we get a larger time frame. That's when you get an instant reversal. And y'all don't want to be involved in that. And it's going to be too late. Like I said, you probably won't be able to take nothing out type thing. You, you just going to be sitting there watching whatever you have <laughs> go to zero. For all you know, it may even go into the negative. And you know the same, the people I'm talking about? Y'all know what I'm talking about. Y'all don't want to be in the negative now. But anyways, back to the four hourly. Like I said, we're about to go to our level two formation. And as y'all can see, a pattern has already formed. We got an M. Y'all see a little red candle right there? Clear M to the dub. They even got a W right here to make another W and a W and a W. Like, this how you know it is so planned out. They or You know what I'm saying? It's so obvious. Like I said, they always love doing things by threes. And this is how the pattern goes. We got the M retracing. Boom. Once you see that, you know, that's how you know it's good. So that's level one, level two, level three. Then the peak formation right here. And then the reversal, the, the, the reset, basically. But it literally reset it and continued on to a whole nother pattern. So you know that, that you know what I'm saying? You got to think about it. Like my last video, and y'all should know by now, the U.S. development on debt, like, like, come on, bro. Like, why is the market skyrocketing? That's not suspicious to y'all. You feel me? You know, things about to get wild here, man. They taking that last run. Like I said, it's the last run. And they going to make sure they take everything they can. So right here on the daily, right? Like I showed y'all, even way back here. Like, we've been we're supposed to come up here to hit this, this range. See, what I was believing, we should come up here to recover this candlestick. A long time ago. I'm talking about like way back here in July type thing. After you first came. Like that's what I thought I was going to do right here. I leave everything on my charts. And I tell y'all to write down where I see my charts. You want to say so I can understand and watch it play out. So you can understand how the, how the markets really work. Because y'all have to do this to really get a get a foot a grip on it. Just how I know where it be going. And how it's going to turn around and all that type of stuff. But anyways, you can, you can predict the markets. And even y'all look here, right? This would be an a M right here. And this could be a W right here. You know what I'm saying? Look at the 20 MA. It almost was like a W and an M. They made it so obvious. Even the right leg of this W is a whole nother pattern. You know what I'm saying? So you can't even miss it. So boom, you got a level one. This is level two. And you see, basically, we come out the gap. Like I said, we, we broke out the gap. Get that bounce off. Boom. It, it is so organized. You see the MA is like, like it, it is organized. That's how you know it's suspicious. And right here, level two, how I know it's going to stop. It's a recovery of this candlestick right here. Look at it. Look at where it's trying to bounce off of and where it's staying above. It's so obvious. You can read these charts. And that's why I'm trying to get y'all to see and, 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 you know what I'm saying, understand. You look to the left, left of the, of the dotted line. You know, that's the top of the candlesticks. You know what I'm saying? The resistance lines. Like, everything is, is, is so obvious. You can literally read these charts. So, this is how I know. We about to come up here. See, this right here literally came up. And recover half of this, the candlestick. Literally, the box of the candle. Look, literally, half of the candlestick. That's how you know we should still come up and recover this whole candlestick. And we should get a reversal. And this thing is around $26,600. Around this general range, we should be getting a reversal. And we def definitely cannot. You know what I'm saying? I doubt we see some. You know what I'm saying? 30-something. I doubt they do that and go that ham. But anyways... Once you come up here, because that'll be a hit to the 200 EMA on the daily also. That'll be the level three, you know what I'm saying? And reversal around this range. Well, obviously, you know what I'm saying? They, gonna, they could drag it out however long they want to until this 200 EMA actually come down here. So we could, you know what I'm saying? Get the reversal. So expect that once you see a 200 EMA hit. But also keep in mind, they don't have to hit a 200 EMA at all. That could really get you, you know what I'm saying? They can get me. But y'all just got to watch out for stuff like that. But also, so boom, I got y'all on the weekly. As y'all can see, I had this chart for so long, 
and look like you know what I'm saying it played out just like my my chart show and it's same sitting for like a whole year you can do this on any time frame you know what I'm saying a 5 15 minute the hourly any time frame literally this is the week you do it on weekly but overall like I've been telling y'all since this day one you know what I'm saying we in a markdown phase there's no point of going long and that's why I've been stressing because I do know at least 85% of people that trade usually go long. And that's the whole point of me making my videos to get you to understand how to read these charts and understand you probably shouldn't be going long right now because it will be in a, in a bad situation and it's going to be real quick. No matter how much money you made all year long, that thing can go in this type of move right here that's about to happen. Like they take your drawings off, right? Boom. Now you make it look nice. Got a nice W. Boom. But look how overextended that is. We just come up and just hit this one hundred AMA. Like I said, that's the right there around twenty five thousand dollars, and that may not you don't know say have to be a, a full recovery of this candlestick because also look to the left. This first initial drop, I'm gonna say the exact low, the exact low. Of this thing is twenty five thousand three hundred and thirty eight dollars and fifty three cent of this candlestick. So that can literally be the exact point it return it, it turns around because that technically is a recovery of this candlestick when you see these wicks right here. So they have to wick all the up here, and there'll be a complete recovery of everything right here. So what they gotta do next and make a recovery right here. And like I said, if this drop right here, like the higher high we go, the, the 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 worse the drop is gonna be. And that's what I'm trying to explain. Like like the numbers I gave before has definitely went up, but it's it's to the point I probably don't even want to say the number because it's about to be really bad. But as of right now, after that. This movie making, I believe we should be coming to ten thousand dollars. And if you look to the left right here, around ten thousand know dollars, you know what I'm saying? See the box of this candlestick, the bounce of this. Because first of all, like I always told y'all, you see this is a large head and shoulders. The head and shoulder formation always have to the, the stop where it, where it started basically. And y'all can clearly see it came about broke out and it started right here around ten thousand dollars. Y'all see the resistance, resistance, especially this doji right here. You know what I'm saying? That's super support. So I mean, that's that's like the next level we're looking at. Cause the only way I expect, cause we could come right here around, you know, what I'm saying around eleven thousand five hundred, right, and slow down a little, little bit. But we should ultimately get this ten thousand drop. Cause I rather this ten thousand drop instead of the, the, this, 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 you know, what I'm saying eleven thousand five hundred. You know, even if it do stop there, you you might have a chance to, to get a little something. But I wouldn't even mess with it. Cause once it's around ten thousand dollars, that's when we're gonna make this final drop and recover this last count stick around fifty five hundred dollars, just like it did before. But look, it did the same thing before. Y'all look on this one. Last run, run it did, it came up. It just looks small now because, it, you know what I'm saying, it's a, you know what I'm saying, this is when it first started. It was large at first, too. And look at that. W. Clear W. Level 1. Level 2. Level 3. Peak formation. Reset. Even did it over here. Look at that. W. Level 1. Level 2. Level 3. Peak formation. And as y'all can see, it came down with a nasty wick and recovered all these candlesticks and shot right back up and stopped right there on the 100 EMA. We have never been below the 100 EMA. And this is how you know it's about to get really serious because what we could bounce off of, nothing besides the EMAs. But there's no more EMAs. We just got our last support. So everything about to be looking really crazy, man. But clearly y'all see this 50 is about across the 100. So it could just be like, that never happened either. Even right here. The 50 didn't cross the 100 over here. So, I mean, this is about to be extremely serious, you feel me? And this is y'all final warning. Like I said, this 100 EMA. So, anywhere between, basically, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, 26,600. I'm going to say 26,500. Keep it simple. Y'all better be looking out. Because it could be a quick recovery to all these. You know what I'm saying? It's going to be a nasty candlestick to at least right here to recover it. When anybody's hopped in, Within the last week or two or three, last month, you about to lose all your money. And it's going to be in an instant, too. I'm just throwing it out there. But it's going to continue on down. Like I also say, around $10,000, be super cautious. So anyway, let me slide out a little further so I'll show you the monthly chart. Y'all can see another M to the dub. Head and shoulders, the retracement. This is how I know. This is another pattern on the monthly chart. It has to come down and do this. So whenever it does do this, we have to have a close of about $10,000 in all months to keep this pattern valid. So whenever we do do this, like the last drop to $5,000, it's going to be within the same month and it's going to be the same recovery. 
So it's going to be a quick drop than a recovery. And I believe the recovery, recovery could be all the way up around $14,000. But the thing is, we won't see an uptrend until we bounce off $14,000. You feel me? But we got to watch all this play out. Because once it starts dropping, it's, it's about to start moving fast. And we're going to really start seeing its intentions. Because they about to drain everybody, man. So y'all just be, be on the lookout. And don't say nobody ain't tell you nothing. But anyways, anything I just said is not financial advice at all. Y'all grown. Y'all make your own decisions. But like, comment, and subscribe. Peace.